Greetings and welcome to this new video. I hope you are all doing well. In this video, we will be jailbreaking iOS 17.4 on all your parent supported devices. And this will also fix your app store apps crashing while you are jailbroken. And after a successful jailbreak, I will also show you how you can install Troll Store. And if this works beyond iOS 17.4, I will mention that in the description and I will update it in the title as well after fully testing it. Also, please note that on iOS 17, Palerain only supports rootless. So I will show you the version first of all on my device. As you can see, iOS 17.4 and you can see it in iTunes as well. One more thing that your passcode or your touch ID will work while you are jailbroken. Now for this method, we will be using Palenix, which you can use to create a bootable USB flash drive and you can use it on your Windows PC to jailbreak your device. The method shown in this video along with Palenix and Pale Rain is completely free. So as you can see, we are at the official GitHub page for Pale Next and at the Pale Rain, you can see that the latest version is beta 9.1, which fixes App Store apps crashing. And as of making this video, Pale Next has not been updated to support the latest beta 9.1. So what I did is I created this custom Pale Nix ISO file for you, which includes the changes for beta 9.1, and this will fix all your apps store apps crashing while you are jailbroken. Also, if you are watching this video after the Pale Nix has been updated to support the beta 9.1 changes or later, please use this one instead. All right. Also, you will find the link in the description or in the pinned comment for this custom Palenex Beta 9.1 ISO. Now to flash it onto your USB flash drive, you can use Rufus. You can simply head to the official website for Rufus and get it from here. And then simply open it. And now please plug in your USB flash drive. All right. Now simply drag and drop the ISO, the Palenix ISO onto Rufus. Leave it to MBR and here UEFI, it is okay. Now simply hit start and then select write in DD image mode, all right. And then hit okay. Also please back up all your data on this USB flash drive because it will be deleted and then hit okay. All right, and you will see writing image and this will take one to two seconds. All right, once done, you will see ready here. Now we can restart the PC and boot from this USB flash drive. All right, guys, so after restarting your PC, go to your boot manager by pressing F9 or F12, depending on your computer's manufacturer. And then make sure that secure boot and fast boot is disabled in BIOS. All right, and then simply boot from your USB flash drive. You will find your USB flash drive right here. So I will simply press enter here and let it load. This will take one to two seconds and you will see the pale next. And make sure your device is connected via USB and on your device, you will find this trust this computer dialog, hit trust. And then from here, simply select pale drain. All right, the first option and then hit the start button and your device will go into recovery mode straight away as you can see it on my device and then simply press enter and get your device into dfu mode by simply following the instructions on screen and as you can see the process is now continuing so i will not be cutting this video here so that you can see that it works without any issues all right as you can see, my device booted up to the normal mode without any issues. Also, if you see that it is stuck here at booting kernel, please do not worry. Make sure that your device booted up successfully and you have the pale rain loader. Now you're good to go. Don't worry about the booting kernel stuck. All right, now let's boot back to Windows and then I will show you how to set it up. Now press Control C 
and you will see this prompt now type exit and press enter you will see this menu then go to reboot and press enter and then remove the usb flash drive and it will boot back to windows all right guys so we are back on device and you can see i have the parent loader now on my home screen and i want to show you the version again so that you can confirm that it is 17.4 all right and you can see the belt also all right now you can see for this test i have this app installed so that you can test that the app's crashing issue is now fixed or not as you can see it is working just fine without any issues we'll test it again after the jailbreak is complete now simply open the parent loader and make sure you are connected to the internet hit cilio and then hit install now from here set a passcode of your choice it can be anything but make sure there are four characters hit set and you'll find install completed hit close and you'll find cilio on your home screen now let's open it you can see it is working just fine without any issues you can see the version here and yes we can update the packages without any issues so i will update them all right as you can see it completed without any errors now guys let's again test the installed app store app to see if it crashes or not as you can see it is working just fine no crashes whatsoever no issues here now if you want to install troll store you can simply open cilio then you can search for troll store helper and get it and install it also please note that troll store on this version will only work while you are jailbroken all right then hit done go back and you'll find troll helper now from here you can install troll store your device will respring and once you go in you'll find troll store on your home screen you can open it and it will install ldid now from settings you can install a persistence helper if you want and once i go back you can see it is working just fine you can also see it here that the boot arg to prevent apps store apps crashing is properly put also if you ever wish to remove the jailbreak you can simply hit revert install and then hit revert install again this will reboot your device and the jailbreak will be removed that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself